Hello everyone, I'm McKenna Maduli, your PTC 22 host, here with our special guest for what's happening today, Joao Lima from the editor of Tech Capital. Busy day Tuesday. Tell me a little bit about what you heard that happened yesterday. Um, every day is a busy day at PTC. <laughs> Everyone's busy at PTC. <laughs> um, I think, I mean, we mentioned the, the, the investment panel um, yesterday, and again, that panel was good. So all the, the, the private equity guys um, are going to be investing further. I mean, that's not a surprise. Um, I think what's interesting is, and they mentioned it slightly, and I've been hearing that a lot in the corridors um, of the conference, is inflation. Uh, I think... I'm not going to use the word people are concerned because I don't think people are concerned at this stage yet, but people are keeping an eye out on inflation and interest rates. Um, and of course, this is a consequence of COVID. And I think the next 12 months are going to be very telling. Um, and uh, it really brings you into the real world because in the real world, we're already feeling um, the inflation. Yeah, so you right. go to a supermarket in London, in Paris, um, New York, Mexico City, and you can see the things have gone up. You want to buy a car, you can't buy a car. Um, so the supply chain is still a bit wombly, even though data centers have managed to, to go around that now and really sign different vendors and more vendors. Uh, the vendors have, the manufacturers have built more factories um, to really supply the regional demands and all that. So that's going to be interesting to see. They didn't go too much into that, but I think uh, in the next 12 months, that's a hot topic. It is going to be, yeah, yeah, depending on how things go. I think it was quite interesting to see a young generation come in to talk yesterday, uh, the PTC Young Scholars. Uh, we heard from PhD graduates from the University of Southern California, Cape Town, Oxford, and Harvard Business School. Wow. Um, they shared where they are with their academic research. And I think an interesting point to, to really look at when young people talk is to see what they are focused on, because they are the next leaders, they are the next... The future. They are the future. Great. So, But it's interesting to see what they are focused on, and they're really, really focused on sustainability. Um, in different ways than the industry is at the moment. Uh, and then the other thing I was very um, pleased by is that they are really looking into digital behavior. Uh, mm -hmm. Because we, we spent days, I mean, even this week, we spent some time talking about investment uh, and how much money is going to the industry. And it's very fun and games to talk about how much money is coming in. But the thing is, this is really impacting people's lives. It's um, how dependent we are of digital, of platforms and everything. Bear in mind, social media didn't exist pretty much 15 years ago. Um, and people have become addicted. So it's interesting to see that it's the younger generations are really driving this discussion around on how to behave around that. Um, and it's the right time to have that discussion as well. It's with important. The, the, I was just going to yeah. add, that's very important. Yeah, especially with all the conversation around the metaverse. And if you're going to live into this real slash physical um, sorry, physical slash virtual world. Um, th we need to have those discussions now, even within our industry. Uh, even though we're building the real world, we are building the real world for the virtual world. So right. <laughs> it's really important. So it. that probably doesn't go very well together, but um, I, I thought that was very, very good to hear. Cool. Yeah. Wednesday, it's the final day yeah. of PTC 22. Yeah. What are you looking forward to today? Uh, yeah, I think today we're going to have some talks on sustainability. Um, again, mm -hmm. big topic. Um, we, we're going to look at the zettabyte economy. This is no longer a gigabyte or anything. This is zettabytes now. Data is just exploding. Everything yeah. is exploding, so yep. <laughs> frequently speaking. Uh, but we're going to hear from uh, people from Shiora. So Shiora has got a massive investment from Edge Connects as well mm -hmm. um, in China. So, of course, data there, it's massive. Yep. Uh, Asia is huge when it comes to using their devices. So there's no one better than to talk about that than someone who has a business in China serving the market. Um, we're also going to have people from Oracle, ABB, uh, and Sonal Gupta from Yacht Infrastructure, um, whose, whose parent company, he's just putting $3.88 billion uh, into his business to expand across India. Uh, and that's only a fraction of what that country needs. Wow. So that's going to be much more. So it'll be interesting to see what they say. Um, around sustainability. And then I think just to close, I'll just mention another one because there's a session around the implications of digital adoption uh, for economic development. So mm -hmm. we all know that our industry has a massive impact on people's lives, but it also has a massive impact on economies uh, and it really contributes to the GDP. But again, that notion around uh, digital behavior and how digital impacts our lives is very, very important. Uh, and we heard two days ago from um, Dr. Julie Albright, who is a digital sociologist, uh, and Nancy Novak from Compass Data Centers, around the digital divide on how a lot of people are getting left behind. So I think this session is quite good to complement their session two days ago um, and really close off the conference uh, on a high note. Um, yeah, so there's still a lot happening there's for the last day. <laughs> I know. Did you enjoy your first time here at PTC? Very much so, and I'm super thankful for PTC to allow me to be here, and I'm super looking forward to next year. Yeah, me yeah. too. And until then, I am your PTC host, McKenna Maduli. We will see you all next year for PTC 23. Aloha. Have a nice flight back to London. Thank you. It's going to be a I'm long one. <laughs> all right, we'll see you guys next Bye. year. Aloha.